Hi, I'm Trish from Speedwell. In this clip, we're going to look at very short answer questions in the Speedwell eSystem. Here, I've set up a very short answer question. I've populated the author, the code, the question text, the title, and I've put the model answer in, which is the expected answer to the question. I'm ignoring the first character case. Here we can add the correct answer and the variations of that we can accept. I've added one and I'm going to put another one in as well. I'll put LVH in here, that's acceptable. We can have lots of answers in here, but I'll just stick to two for now. I'll save this question and then close it. We're now seeing a student take an exam, which has a very short answer question in it. The student will add the answer in the text box and then complete the rest of the exam. This very short answer and multiple choice exam has been completed and marked automatically. But we can check the marking of the very short answers. Here we see the question text and the model answer. The table below shows the answers entered by the students in the test. The highlighted green answers are the correct answers and they'll automatically receive a mark. Anything that's highlighted red is incorrect. So we check through those answers to see if there's anything we'd accept and we'd allocate a mark to that in here. When we check through all the answers, we close. Once an exam has been completed, there are various reports available. This is the item analysis report. We can see the statistics for the exam at the top and we can then report on each of the very short answer questions, including the facility and the mean score and the pentile histogram on the right. The rest of the report shows the data for the multiple choice questions in the exam. Students can see their feedback reports after the exam as is shown here. In this report, we've grouped the questions into very short answers and choice answers, so they can see how many of the questions they got correct as a percentage, what their score was, and their performance arrow on the end. I hope you found this clip useful. If you'd like more information about very short answer questions, the Speedwell eSystem, or you'd like to book a free demo, please contact us at speedwellsoftware.com.